Hey YouTube, it's Christina and Ronald. We are here for our 10 week pregnancy vlog. Why are you laughing? Because it just made like a silly smile. You'll see it later. Later? Yeah. And I guess we're here, you know, I wanted to let everyone know how I'm feeling at 10 weeks. Such a drag. I feel like I'm like 55 weeks pregnant. I know that's non-existent, but that's how I feel. Um, I still have like really, really, really chat lips. I have been drinking water because I'm noticing that they're getting like worse and worse. Have I been drinking water? She has. And they're still chapped, correct? Oh, really? Really bad. Um, I do have uh, anemia, so I don't know if that has anything to do with anything, but chap lips. Um, over the past couple days, I've had like really sore butt muscles. I don't know why. That sounds bad, but like getting on this floor today was so painful. It hurt. Don't laugh at me. I'm sorry. Okay. Um, outside of that, um, sleeping has become a little uncomfortable because I've I've had some type of stomach discomfort. How many weeks are you? Ten. Nine. Oh, snaps. Nine. I don't even know how far along I am. This is the nine, ninth week pregnancy wow. vlog, vlog. I'm sorry. I'm nine weeks pregnant. Not that many. Where she get ten from? I don't know. Ten sounds <laughs> good. <laughs> I said I feel horrible. Um. Yeah. What were other symptoms I've had? Those are pretty much. We went it, to Cold Stone tonight, and um, she kind of yummy. She really wanted ice cream, so we had to. It was only like a ten minute drive. Though. Ice cream and crab sticks. That's what she wanted. Ice cream and crab sticks. I, I have had a couple different cravings for specific things. So like dinner time now, he's always like, "What do you have a taste for?" Because um, I can so. eat uh, grilled chicken and vegetables. Because I'm just like, dude, it really doesn't matter. Not dude, but it really doesn't matter to me. Like chicken and vegetables. boring vegetables with no salt. Yeah, we don't eat salt. Um, that's a good thing because he does MMA and no, I I practice MMA, so Holy. not yet a fighter, but hoping to be one day. You will be. Um, thank you. You're welcome. Hmm. You guys can see I'm like I'm really drained. I'm just I just want to sleep all day. Um, but not necessarily sleep. A lot of times I just want to be in the bed underneath my cover, under my two pillows, because like I said, sleeping has become a little uncomfortable. So I sleep with a pillow like tucked up against my side. We were supposed to go to Target or Walmart and invest in one of those so pregnancy looking pillows, but we were, we had got our floor done and it's just like, we didn't have any time. I did some grouting yesterday and we did some, we grouting, did some grouting yesterday. I don't think she should have been doing it, but yeah, we did some growling yesterday. Are we oh. talking too low? Can they hear us? No, they, they, you guys can hear us, right? Good. Yes, we can hear you. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, that's, that's pretty much been it. Basic stuff. Um, I haven't been reading my book. She hasn't been using her uh, journal. I haven't been doing much of anything. This has been sleeping. a lazy, lazy yeah. week. I'm so looking forward to the second trimester because I'm just so looking forward to everyone saying her book told her it would get better in the second trimester. Everything gets so much better. So I'm like, okay, a couple more weeks, a couple more weeks. And he always tries to encourage me and say, hopefully it'll get better. And by your doctor's appointment, you'll be better. And the baby has fingers now. Excellent. Excellent. It's like waving at you right now. It's probably waving to YouTube saying hello or trying to. But, you know, that's, that's it as far as I'm concerned. As far as me as a pregnant woman. So... <gasps> what happened? Can they still see us? Yes. Oh, okay. There we go. So last week when we were here, we told you we would talk about our adventure to Babies R Us. That was pretty cool. So we went to Babies R Us uh, last yes, Saturday. On his shoulder and go to sleep. And I'll talk for a little while. We went to Babies R Us uh, last Saturday and um, we walked in and it was just like, wow. 
all of this baby stuff. Now I have a goddaughter and I've been in there once to get her like a swing and I have a brother that I'm 13 years older than and I remember like my mom and my stepdad going in there uh, getting like his crib and all of his stuff and everything like that and that was pretty exciting so when we went in there it was pretty cool they had uh, this like tub with like just like, like a engine like a whirlpool tub. I didn't think that was too safe for a kid so um we took I wasn't too list. keen off of that so I took that we we took that off the list but I made a a head chief uh decision and took that off the list <laughs> um the so we head honcho. so we walked around and uh, we went into the little section where they had like the 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 bath stuff and we saw like a nice a, ni a couple nice tubs uh we saw the uh a whole bunch of monkey stuff I really, 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 really like the whole monkey theme. I so mean, that's gonna be be the uh, the nursery theme. It's gonna be little monkeys. Yes. We're gonna have like a mural painted or with like a tree and something. like monkeys hanging from the tree. Not monkeys, but like maybe like two or three monkeys hanging from the tree and like bananas and like fruits and stuff like that. I but, told him the baby's gonna come out and be scared of monkeys. So then what's he gonna do? No, we're gonna have a strong, strong, strong girl <laughs> um, ah, yeah we've, we've decided that it's a girl i figure if i keep saying girl maybe a boy will come but you know back the babies are us so we uh looked at like some bottles and dr brown's guys tell me what you think below about dr brown's bottles down there so we uh we walked around and we saw the car seats. As soon as as soon as she saw this one car seat, she fell in love with it. I mean it's really nice. Uh it's the safety one on board uh thirty five air infant seat. Uh don't it's tell them they might try to go buy the all McKinney. Of them. It's in there already. Everybody I mean <sighs> anyway. Okay, YouTube, we'll share with you. Who cares? Who cares? Uh, but it's a uh, it's a really nice car seat. Really, really nice. I mean, it looks like it keeps the baby nice and snug and comfortable. And the people on Babies R Us website gave it some good reviews. And I checked on Amazon.com and it has a couple good reviews. And I mean, it's really nice. So, um, we yeah, we looked at, we just looked at a lot of things and yeah, that was the first thing know. that we really looked at and we were just like. That's really nice. You know, that's something that we definitely have to get. Yeah. Um, yeah, I want to talk, too. I'm sorry. Go ahead. You, you don't want me to talk? You said you were going to sleep. I just want to let I'm you sleep, weak. you know? Woke me up to do this video vlog. I did. I begged her all day. Ugh. And now I'm up and he doesn't want to let me talk. All right, go ahead. Okay. I don't even know what I wanted to say anymore. So we left off with the stroller. Did we? Yeah. We were talking about a stroller? Not stroller, the uh, car seat. Oh, so then that means we have to talk about a stroller because the two are one and the same. Yeah. Um, I don't remember us really picking the stroller because they all suck to me. They all look flimsy or they all looked boring or, you know, we want to stick with a neutral color because I don't want to know what the baby sex is, but he's saying he wants to know what the baby sex is. So as of right now, we're so early in the game that, you know, anything can become anything. It's like a complete toss up. Like people may say we've decided to go to Babies R Us too early, but we're deciding to purchase a lot of the bigger pieces of furniture ourselves. And we have a reason for doing that that we, we won't uh, discuss here on YouTube. Nah. But we have a reason why we're doing this. We do. We're not insane. In the membrane. Insane in the membrane. Insane in the brain. <laughs> yeah, so I mean, really, we looked at cribs, cribs, and chairs, bedding. And and the cribs thing was like we were going back and forth with the freaking back crib, and forth, like back and forth. We want one of the uh, four and what's one. it called? The four and one, the life. Yeah. Something you know. It evolves from, with your child. It does. Yeah. And some of those cribs, man, they looked really fun. Like I'm like, can I just turn I was this like, into? An adult bed. And I was in sleep. Babies R Us, like literally, like trying to pick the freaking bed up to like see if, like, you know, what I'm, I'm a pretty strong guy, so you know, I mean, I'm, I'm like, like, who's gonna go in the baby's room, Ronald, and like, pick up the baby and just sway it across the room? He's like, you never know. I mean, we do have a dog. 
Maybe one day he'll go a little cuckoo and say, let me try to pick it up. But I doubt really, it. He's a good dog. We'll introduce him next week. We'll introduce him. Next week. I don't know about next week. But next week. We'll introduce him. Hey, Mr. Biggs. Hi, fat man. Anyway, um, but Babies R Us was an adventure. We looked at, like, I, like we said, uh... Cribs, strollers. The only thing we haven't looked at yet is clothes. Like, yeah, but we did decide once second trimester hits, yeah, that we are going to buy Pampers every week and clothing. So we'll stack up, and you know, we're hoping by March that we have everything, everything as far as furniture wise for the baby, like everything, <laughs> like have everything out of the way. Even if the room isn't set up yet, we hope to just have everything just sitting in the room. Just waiting for little him or her to get here. Correct. Uh, we want to be prepared. This will be our first child, and we're Maybe excited that, about it. So, it. yeah, I think. We've been talking to a lot of people, and. I'm thinking one. Because a lot of people say it's selfish, but we're both like, we're both people that like, like the best thing in life. Like, we want like the we best do. things in life. We like good things. And we you like know, expensive we things. like expensive things as well, but we want we want our kid, you know, to be healthy and, you know, to be just to have the best opportunities in life. And the way like the economy is going and things are going, everybody will say it improved, but I really don't see it improving. Like I'm like one of those guys who like, you know, I'm like really into everything. But I just really want our kid to like have like the best thing in life. And if we choose, you know, later on down the road that we'll have, you know, another kid. You know, that's in God's will, but but for now, one. 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 one, one. Alright, so I mean I, I guess that's it for today. I Why is she trying to cut us off our early? Cause I wanna lay down. Okay, so we're gonna cut the video off because she wants to lay down. No, I mean what else do you want to talk about? No, I don't have anything else to talk have about. Have you been reading your book? I started reading my book because somebody said uh, I was getting too uh, too ahead of myself. Why didn't you read my book? I have book? this app on my... Uh, he does have an app. I don't my, have any apps. On my Evo, where pretty much like every week, it shows you like, you know, the things like how the baby... It actually shows you pictures how the baby is growing. And I'm like so amazed with it every week. So He is. Like it doesn't let you go ahead to see the pictures that they're going to show you for the week before. So I have to That's wait like every thing. week. That's a good thing. As you can hear by the book, he loves to progress, and the baby will be like 15, and he's like, this is what it's going to look like. Yeah. So, but that's, again, that's like I, I love him for that, because you can see I'm totally a slacker. I'm not always like this, I promise. Don't make any faces like that. You disagree with me? Uh, she's a, not a slacker. Uh, hopefully, <sighs> she's a slacker. Wow. She's a slacker. We're really going to have to cut this short because he and I need to talk about She's this. She's a slacker. I'm not a slacker. She's a slacker. Sometimes, but I mean, I, I feel like we're dragging the video out. Anyway. We want YouTube to love us. We're 13 minutes in. and We, we did have... good because I thought we were not even going to make it to 10. Yes. Okay. But um, we look forward to talking to you guys during week 10 next week, not week 10 this week. <laughs> Official week 10. <laughs> uh, we hope you guys have a happy... Why well, did she just give us that villain laugh? <laughs> yes, um, guys, have a happy Thanksgiving. Um, enjoy it. If you're going out for Black Friday, be safe and don't kill anybody. Um, be very safe. Enjoy your turkey day, though. Bye, guys.